one of my favorite values right now in dynasty drafts and in dynasty leagues in general is Deontay Johnson. Are we buying or are we selling Deontay Johnson? Let's talk about it. Before we get into it, guys, do me a quick favor there. Smash that like, smash that subscribe if you're new. Let's get right to it. Deontay Johnson last year finishes PPR wide receiver 30 on 147 targets, 86 catches, 882 yards, zero touchdowns. And still finished wide receiver 30, which is a huge reason why he is still a buy for me in Dynasty. Wide receiver 30, no touchdowns. That has to come up. Kenny Pickett has to get better. They've addressed the offensive line, bringing in Broderick Jones, bringing in Carnell Washington at tight end, which is essentially just another blocker to help the offensive line. We know the talent of Deontay Johnson. We've seen what he can do and what he can produce. Now, obviously, Ben Roethlisberger is not there anymore to just sling the football around. Now you've got Kenny Pickett. We're going to hope he takes that next step up because we know the talent of Deontay Johnson. We know the technician of a route runner he is. We know the separation that he can get easily on defenders. And we take a look at his reception perception profile from 2021. You can see all the green here. This guy is an elite route runner. 91st percentile, 98th percentile, 89th percentile, 77% against man coverage, 88% against zone, 79 against press. This guy is getting open at an elite rate, and he's commanding elite targets. I mean, he is in the top of the league at those targets, 144, 169, 147. Targets are opportunities which equal fantasy points. And even in a down season last year, he still finished top 30 with absolutely zero touchdowns. Now, that most likely is going to improve. The chances he scores zero touchdowns against are probably slim. Take a look at where he's ranked in keep trade cut. I mean, wide receiver 37 in the same range as guys like Rashard Bateman, Amari Cooper, Christian Kirk, Chris Godwin. And you're going to have to hold him because you're not going to be able to get rid of him for much. If you are a team that's in contention and want a cheap player that you can buy, go after Deontay Johnson. I mean, he's going for like a late first, early second round pick as far as what his value is. So I'm absolutely buying and I love drafting him late in dynasty leagues, especially if you start drafting a contending team, depending how you want to build up your squad. Deontay Johnson is a perfect guy to grab incredibly late. He can be your wide receiver four or five, depending how you draft. But again, improvement in offensive line, improvement at the quarterback position, because we expect Kenny Pickett to take that next step. And a commanding of targets from Deontay Johnson, as usual, we see that the absolute floor, which is where he's being drafted at right now, is wide receiver 30. A horrible season with no touchdowns. That is the floor. The floor is wide receiver 30. Let's just think about that for a second. That's his absolute floor. That'll wrap it up for this video, guys. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Let me know down there in the comments what y'all think about Deontay Johnson. Are you in or are you out on Deontay? Drop it in the comments there. But before y'all get out of here, just do me a quick favor. Smash that like. Smash that subscribe if you are new. See y'all on the next one.